Simba, wait! It's Nala! Don't you recognize her? Nala? It's me, Simba! Simba! You are alive! Hey, what's going on here? <laughs> Don't worry. They're all friends of mine. So that means nobody's planning to eat anybody else for lunch, right? Are you sure they don't want to eat me? Like I'm some kind of pig? We won't, but you are a pig, right? Call me Mr. Pig! <laughs> <laughs> Could you guys excuse us for a few minutes? Why am I not surprised? Simba, you've got to come back to Pride Rock. I thought Sora might be able to help, but you're the only one who can save us from Scar. I can't go back. Why? Hakuna Matata. It's something I learned out here. Sometimes bad things happen, and there's nothing you can do about it. Simba? Hakuna? Matata! Hakuna? Matata! He's not the Simba I remember. Something about Hakuna Matata. My father's dead, and it's because of me. It's my fault. I can't go back. It won't change anything. Look at the stars. The great kings of the past look down on us from those stars. So whenever you feel alone, just remember that those kings will always be there to guide you. And so will I. Father, are you there? Simba, you have forgotten who you are. You must take your place in the circle of life. How can I go back? I'm not who I used to be. Remember who you are. You can all come out now. I'm going back to face my past. I could use your help. He really is a king. That was the Lion King abridged, I guess. So, um, Simba has rejoined our party. This time, not as a summon, but as actual um, member of the party. And we also get the Circle of Life Keyblade. Something I do actually want to equip on Sora. <clears throat> so, yeah. So, with that said, I well, may as well explore the Oasis here. I was not able to get that one singular thing. 
Also, we can also get the um, Lord's Broom for um, Donald, which is a reference to the um, Sorcerer's Apprentice, which is, becomes a lot more prevalent in, um, dare I even say it, uh, Dream Drop Distance. And um, the Dreams Cloud for um, Goofy, who I don't have in my party at the moment, but... Um, We'll probably want to use him at some point, so yeah. So that being said, I will equip the um, Lord's Broom on Donald, and I think that'll be it for now. Maybe more synthing can be done in getting us um, an AP boost and a Serenity Stone, so yeah. Not much else I can do except get a Soldier Earring, I guess. So yeah, I'll give. I don't know if I'll give that to anyone, but there you go. Um, I don't know if I have any recipes, so that's out as well. So, with that said, I guess I'm going to head for Pride Rock. And I might as well go over Simba's combat here as well, because um, I don't think we face... Um, they don't even see it. Uh, Scar in this episode. I think that's in the next one. So, yeah. But... Oh boy, if I thought Sora was good in combat! Oh boy, for lack of better explanation, Simba is a real animal, seriously. He goes into a spin whenever he goes near the um, thing. Seriously, seeking out his prey. In this case, the Heartless, of course. So yeah, he especially is good at taking out the bigger Heartless, the um, Wildebeest looking harmless and whatnot, so I don't know if they call Wildebeest or not, maybe not. <coughs> Excuse me! So that being said, um, let's deal with the other thing, and I'm also kind of glad I kept Donald in my party for his uh, spells. The downside with Simba is um, he does use a lot of um, MP by using that charge move, I guess. Although he does come in with a few ethers, does Simba, so... Yeah. That does work. Oops, even though we're getting some new Heartless here, I'm not sure. And he also makes quick work with that spin move, seriously. So yeah, no complaints with Simba in the party. Hell, we now have the rightful king here. Seriously, so and that being said, let's get a load more money. Seriously, the, those bird harvests are dropping quite a bit of money there. Seriously. Okay, well, I wish. Um, <coughs> excuse me. There are some, some weird. Uh, I don't know what to call them, really, those harvests. Those are floating around like some sort of mask on the ground. That is strange. <coughs> but yeah, they resemble a mask or something. Like some sort of African mask or something like that. So yeah, floating around. I don't know what they do, so yeah. I'm guessing they're like... Really... Witch doctors or something? Which is kind of weird, because... You'd think they'd fit more in again with the deep jungle world. <coughs> oh, excuse me. But no, Square Enix refused to use those uh, Heartless from the Deep Jungle, the Bouncy Wilds and Power Wilds and whatnot. <gasps> Wait a minute, we're gonna fight your uncle for this? Yes, Timon. This is my home. Simba, you're alive. This kingdom doesn't belong to you. Simba's the rightful king. The choice is yours, Scar. Either step down or fight. Must this all end in violence? 
I'd hate to be responsible for the death of a family member, Simba. I've put the past behind me. But what about your faithful subjects, have they? Simba, what's he talking about? Go on, tell them who's responsible for Mufasa's death. I am. <gasps> he admits it, murderer. If it weren't for you, Mufasa would still be alive. Do you deny it? No, but it was an accident. You're in trouble again, but this time, Daddy isn't here to save you. And now, everyone knows why. <laughs> now, this looks familiar. I think I've seen this before. Oh, yes. I remember. This is just the way your father looked before he died. Here's my little secret. I killed Mufasa. Murderer! Tell them the truth! All right, all right. I did it. Louder! I killed Mufasa! <laughs> Simba, you get Scar. We'll handle these guys. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. <laughs> 